all right guys so let's see today uh, market behavior and top gainer stocks first you can see this is the uh, nifty and daily chart so uh, as i said yesterday we are looking for buy in the nifty and we placed buy order somewhere here uh, exactly i told yesterday uh, let me show you okay so you can see yesterday close so before uh, not exactly yesterday close uh, i think uh, uh, let me see uh, eight yeah yesterday close somewhere here and the we we place buy order before close the market somewhere here all right and uh, here here you can see our buy order triggered and price gone up so we booked our profit so most of the people are asking me where our sl so we just place previous lower point or at least one atr uh, one atr all right one atr below this lower point and our profit is um, one is to two ratio somewhere there all right uh, somewhere there so we booked our profit somewhere there and if you're not seeing a large time frame like a daily chart price still running in a downtrend so we're expecting uh, they may give a correction very soon okay so uh, according to rsi divergence uh, price are creating higher high you can see and higher high but rsi not able to create a higher high so it may give a correction somewhere near 20 moving embers or 50 moving embers all right and uh, let's see some top uh, stocks and uh, today uh, i can see asian paint so as i said earlier that i have a big investment in asian paint so still i'm holding last two to three years okay so here you can see i think i bought somewhere weekly chart last two to three yeah uh, from that area i'm holding my position area all right even coronavirus during the coronavirus i bought more shares now you can see price gone up so right now we can see price giving a correction according to the weekly chart we have seen some uh, uh, support are there there are 20 moving average let me draw here you can see this is the 20 moving average now act as a support and according to the weekly candle and now we have seen some bullish candle somewhere here and if you want to see daily time frame uh, here you can see price are rejecting this area again and again so price hit and reverse back hit and reverse back somewhere here we have seen double bottom exactly they are forming near 100 exponential moving average at the level of 2 3 uh, let's say 8 0 this is our supporting line so it is a probability to continue toward the upside and uh, right now uh, most of the people are say this is a w pattern yeah i can say w pattern also and uh, let me draw a horizontal line by connecting this uh, showing high point so this call neckline have you seen price hit reverse back hit reverse back and right now exactly uh, near 25 and 25 almost you can say here all right so this line called neckline so we are looking for buy after breaking this neckline remember not now and it's a probability to run like a sideway like that so nobody uh, predict the future uh, which direction price uh, price will go all right so it may break this level or it may run like sideways okay so we need a breakout to enter buy now seen a small time frame like 15 minute the bouncing of uh, 20 moving average uh, somewhere here all right 20 and 50 both are there and now you can see price exactly near 20 moving average 
and uh, 50 is somewhere there so we are looking for buy after breaking this level all right so it is a probability to continue uh, toward upside so this is a good opportunity to enter in this market in asian pain and uh, let's see another stocks uh, here you can see sbi life insurance okay sbi okay no sbi life insurance i didn't add here so leave it so let's check it another stocks hdfc life okay hdfc uh hdfc live this one okay all right now let's see daily time frame and the first uh, see the market behavior uh, now you can see here so similarly we have seen they are running in an uptrend in a large time frame they're getting higher high higher low higher high and the higher low and today you can see price pulls up all right now in that case you can see small uh, time frame so let me show you another thing here so now you can see price pull back hit reverse back hit and pull back again or right now somewhere there all right so you can see inverted head and shoulder pattern also but uh, most of the people are think differently but whatever it's okay uh, let me remove this line remove this line okay uh, let me draw a neckline this is the neckline and we need a breakout so let's just jump to small time frame and now you can see they are running in an uptrend creating higher high pull back higher high pull back and it is a probability to create a new high and we need a breakout so here we will apply breakout trading strategy uh, let's see another stocks uh, ONGC we already discussed the yesterday ONGC ONGC okay uh, yeah this is the ONGC and the daily chart uh, here you can see um, price are running somewhere like that like that this is the actual market range all right so now you can see in that case especially we use uh, option uh, trading strategy uh, now you can see in a large time frame they are running in a sideway so i place here iron condor trading strategy like that all right iron can uh, like sell something here and buy upper stock price uh, four leg will be here and the sell and buy again somewhere like that here so if price stay in between this range we will collect the all premium and if you wanna be a uh, suppose you are a day trader so we are expecting that ongc price will hit this previous uh, level so we will buy uh, to this level only all right now see in a small time frame uh, so as i said we are looking for buy uh, they are bouncing up like that like that and this is the buy opportunity create a new high and another buy opportunity uh, we are expecting that it will continue and hit the 104 level all right this is the ongc and another stocks uh, okay titan so even i have uh, investment in titan also so last four to five years i am holding my position in titan Okay, this on Titan because in a large time frame, Titan is running an uptrend, and they have a good fundamental. According to me, this is a good fundamental, fundamentally good company. So that is why I'm holding my position in Titan also. And if you want to see uh, weekly, we have seen this is the bullish uh, candlestick pattern. And if you want to see here daily time frame, and they are bouncing off specific moving average bouncing of 50 bouncing of 50 bouncing of 50 so we expect that they will create a new high so um, here i can see let me show you supporting line so this is the most recent swing point somewhere there all right so let's see here uh, price of price broke this area first here you can see price broke this area create a new high pull back and that is a buy opportunity exactly this is the buy opportunity create a new high again price pull back we need a buy confirmation so definitely we will go for buy all right they are running in a 
uptrend and the another stocks uh, this is the leading turbo we pro let's see if another leading turbo LT vision turbo this one okay now see in a daily time frame all right uh, here I can see price are too far from moving averages but I'm not interested to buy price are running an uptrend and it's an overbought zone have you seen price uh, pullback near 20 moving average create a new high pullback create a new high and it's probably to uh, and they will give a correction all right so that is why i'm not looking for buy in legend and turbo uh, another with pro the last one let's see with pro okay yeah this one all right uh, this is the we pro still running in uptrend and we have seen their breakout have you seen it? this is called breakout so somewhere there all right they are bouncing off specific moving average 20 moving average bouncing of 20 20 and pull back near 20 and it's a probability to create a new high and let's see i connected this swing point and already broke in this area so i'm looking for buy somewhere there so let's see in a small time frame like 15 minutes or 5 minutes whatever comfortable for you and i can see uh this is our buy opportunity have you seen price broke this 200 exponential moving average and create a new high and pull back to this level so in that case i need a uh, buy confirmation like bullish uh, candlestick pattern and trend line breakout so what is the meaning of that trend line breakout means i want to connect the most uh, recent swing point this one swing point uh have you seen this one swing point this one swing point and they form a bullish confirmation and i need a breakout so once they break so definitely i'll go for buy so i hope you enjoyed this video and if you wanna know more details about the market update you just visit to our website and you can go through there every day i'm uploading there and thanks for watching